Now, when you're defining with the polyline tool, if you left click once, you'll start drawing. We have an option to say, I can type in 350 feet, and now it's giving us a 350 foot line. To draw the next segment, I'll left click once, and then you can see we have another line. If these need to be aligned, there's an option to go over here, turn on a line drawing, or push A, as that's gonna be our shortcut. And then I can click on that. You can see there's gonna be some extensions coming off of it. And then I can go in and update that site. If we need to move around our site, we can left click on this handle, which is gonna drag us around. We can also right click on it. And if we turn off a line drawing, you can see it can let us kind of align that up a bit more from what we want and then push that back to where we need it to go. If we need to make updates to the site lines itself, you can left click and you can drag this around. You can also hold down shift over the edge of a site and you can see how it's adding new points along that line. It then lets you go in and add more points if needed so you don't have to redraw the site if you want to. The other option for defining a site is we can go in and we can type in the length and direction of it as well. So you can see over here, we have the directions as you can kind of see how they're input, the length as well. One thing that I would recommend is leaving off that last um, dimension is as test it will just kind of close that for you.